Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is going to be a reading for Gemini. Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Let's see what's going on. This is your mid-month check-in. Mid to late June 2021. What is going on with my Geminis? I hope you guys had a good birthday season. That's a lot of cards, but let's just have a quick look at them. I'm going to put them back, but I just want a quick look at them. Hmm. Okay. Something to do with um, moving, but perhaps being forced to move or like not being quite ready or something about... Um, Something questioning your stability, your foundations, where you actually live. There could be some kind of renovation going on, home renovation that maybe you weren't anticipating, you weren't ready for, was a lot more difficult than what you expected. Some kind of situation with home, living, um, movement, maybe moving in with someone. It's just, um, it's hard. It's hard. And it's like wanting to take a brand new leap of faith, a new beginning, but then kind of getting stuck sometimes as well. It's like a back and forth or like you want to take a new leap of faith, but then something holds you back and you don't quite, um, quite make it there or quite get there. Okay, we're going to take two. Yeah, there it is again. There's that full card again. Someone wants to take a new leap of faith with you. Someone may even want to move. Someone may even have higher levels of commitment on their mind. Let's see what else is going on here for you, Gemini. Any other messages for Gemini? Then we can get to it. Yeah, we're going to take those three. Ooh, interesting. Okay. We got the lovers at the bottom of the deck. Okay. Gemini um there's someone you're extremely attracted to there is someone who you are looking at you are extremely attracted to it's this person there's someone around you who wants to take a leap of faith towards this they want a new beginning they want a higher level of commitment they want things to go in a certain way this could be someone who is quite traditional quite traditional this, this is an interesting person because this is someone quite traditional, but this is also someone who is willing to, you know, take risks, is willing to um, uh, risk it all, even though they may not know. This is a very optimistic person you're dealing with. We've got Aries here, we've got Taurus, we've got air energy, more Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Um, it could be someone with those elements in very, very key placements in their chart though as well. So even if that's not the sign you're dealing with, if that doesn't come up, they could have it very, very strong, like in their moon sign, for example. Um, and so that's, um, that's sort of guiding this. But this is interesting because this is someone who is maybe sometimes a little bit impulsive. Um, they're impulsive. They're sometimes a little bit impatient very intelligent person surrounding you, they want to take a leap towards you, Gemini. They want to. This is interesting. You are looking at them with a lot of desire. This is someone who you're very physically attracted to. You're interested. You're curious. This person has you. But look, sometimes um, you just want to take a minute. You just want to take a little bit of step back and just analyze the situation before leaping in. Like this person wants to leap in. King of Pentacles energy. Um, this is like so, like this is just boss energy, guys. I don't know what's going on. Um, have you recently like saved a lot of money, made a lot of money, um, advanced in your career, started a business? This is like a real boss entrepreneur type energy. I'm feeling that you guys are doing very, very, very well when it comes to money, stability, finances, this is how you're looking to this other person as well. They're looking at you like someone who is uh, very, very stable, very capable of making a lot of money. Um, mm, yeah, you guys are looking really, really good, strong. You're very strong in um, knowing what you want as well. I feel like um, 
you've got your eye on the prize, but you're not as keen as this person to move forward so quickly. Like you want to think about the situation. You want to make a decision, a decision that's going to be sensible, that's going to be practical. Even though you're very, very interested in this person, you're very attracted. Um, they might be moving a little bit too fast for you or they may be moving a little bit too impulsively. You're going to need to use your intuition on this one. High priestess energy. You know what the right answer is. Seven of wands, you feel like you have to defend yourself with something. You feel like you get a little bit defensive. This person makes you defensive. I don't know what it is. Some of you may be feeling like Some of you may be feeling like someone's trying to change you. Some of you may be feeling like someone's trying to change you. Not necessarily manipulate you, just change you. And you're staying very strong in who you are, in what you believe in. You're staying very, very strong in that. It's taking a lot of work and effort, but you're staying very, very strong. You're not willing to let go your own beliefs, your own mindset, you're not willing to let go of that. Maybe some of you are feeling that a connection with this person or a partnership with this person is going to result in you somehow losing a bit of yourself. And you're so worried and scared about that happening. They're going to keep trying. Someone's going to extend some kind of an offer you, an offer to you. Someone is a little bit more um, in touch with their emotions and they're willing to um, extend themselves. They're willing to put their heart on the line a little bit. They're willing to apologize for things um, in order to sort of get back into your good graces. But we've got lover's energy here. We've got Gemini energy. You are on this person's mind. They're on your mind as well. They're on your mind. You know, they always say that um, Gemini is looking for their other half. They're looking for their twin. They're looking for that person. Um, this is what it's feeling like. But something's holding you back. And you know what? You're not in a rush. Look at this. Hanged man energy right under that. Ace of Pentacles. You're not in a rush to make this offer, but it's there. You're thinking about it. You're thinking about it. See that big pentacle you're holding? You're thinking about you're thinking about making a serious offer. Certainly someone's thinking about making that to you. I feel as though this person wants to hear it from you. They want to hear that what the plans are for the future. They want something solid. They want something committed. Let's see what other messages we want. I don't know that other messages want to come out here. Any other messages, advice, positive affirmations, anything else for my Gemini? Yeah. Um something something is going to move forward soon um with that chariot energy that is not um that is not an energy that's going to stay stuck for very long no in fact um this person is, is feeling like you're not making a decision, like you're kind of stuck in your own mind or you're stuck in your own head or something like that. They really, really want to move things forward. They want to take things to the next level. This energy could be vice versa, but I'm getting strong, strong energy that you are not moving forward yet and they want you to. This person wants to take that leap towards you. They want to get something signed, sealed, delivered. This could be a business thing as well for a lot of you. This could be like a business partnership. This could be someone who you know, wants to get you on board, who wants to sign a contract, who wants to get um, something signed and formalized, some sort of agreement. They want it. You're still not sure because you feel like you don't have all the information. 
I think the time is going to be, or it's going to be soon, um, time soon for a um, conversation. There's going to need to be a conversation. You're going to need to iron out some issues and gain more information by talking about it because at the moment you don't have all the information to move forward. But this person, even though I'm not seeing signs of them giving up anytime soon, they may very well just move on to something else if you don't make a decision um, because they have that impulsive energy of the fool, but they're definitely, <sighs> yeah, they're really wanting things to move forward. I mean, Gemini, what can I say? Take your time. You're in hot demand. <laughs> you're, in, you're in hot demand. I feel a lot of people are looking to you like, um, they're interested and they want a piece of the action, but you know, you take your time, you make the decision that feels right for you, obviously, but you've got someone around you who hundred percent, um, wants commitment, wants a higher, higher level of commitment with you. Very interesting. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed that reading. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you again for watching and I hope to see you all in the next video.